Hello everyone. Today book title is a nature great and a Halloween hunt. Go go go! My name is Nature Great. I am a detective. Tonight I got into trouble. Tonight I was locked in a haunted house with my dog's lodge. I was in big trouble. There were no pancakes there. I was on a case, a Halloween case. It started about an hour ago. My dog's lodge and I were looking out our window. We were waiting for witches and clowns, and Draculas and princesses to ring our doorbell. Suddenly, I heard a scratch at the door, a loud scratch. I went to the door and opened it. Someone was standing there in a long dress, a bonnet, and shirt. He was a little red riding hood grandmother, carrying a trick or treat bag in her big teeth. His big teeth. The grandmother was Annie's dog, Fang. I need to great. Did not think that Halloween was a scary holiday. Until now, where is Annie? I asked him. Does she know you're out alone on Halloween? I did not wait for an answer. I dropped some treats into Fang's bag. He wagged his tail and went down the walk. I closed the door behind him. Clutch crawled out from under a chair. I said to him, "Be brave on Halloween. We do not believe in ghosts and goblins or grandmothers with big teeth." Clutch went back to the window. The doorbell rang. I opened the door. Annie and Rosamond were outside. They were both dressed as little red riding hoods, and they were each carrying a basket covered with a red cloth. Your grandmother was just here, I said to both of them. I know it, Annie said. This is Fang's first year out alone on Halloween. I put some treats in his bag. I said, and now I'll give you some for your basket. My basket is already heavy with treats, Rosamond said. I can't carry any more. Mine isn't full yet, Annie said. She lifted the napkin from her basket, and I dropped some treats inside. I have finished. We trick or treating, Rosamond said. I came here to ask for your help. What kind of help? Of help? One of my cat's little heads is missing, Rosamond said. I hate Halloween. Every year he tries to hide, but this year I can't find him. Where are your other three cats? I said. I I asked. Perhaps a little hasty with them. Oh no, Rosamond said. Every Halloween, super hex, big hex, and plain hex go to the old haunted house on the next street and help to hunt it. Hunted it. But little hex is too scared, so he hides. Wait until tomorrow, I said. Halloween will be over, and little Hex will come out of his hiding place. But he might be really loud, Rosamond said. I'm so worried. I can't eat any of my treats. Please help me. Very well. I need to great. Will take your case. Tell me when was the last time you saw little Hex? He was following Annie and me. Rosamond said, "Where did you go tonight?" I asked. First, I put on my costume. Rosamond said, and then I went to.